A uh, fifth victory in six years for Paris Saint-Germain, who won the match by the smallest of margins, just a 1-0 thanks to Neymar Jr. in the 14th minute. A match which, if truth be told, changed after the half hour when Loïc Perrin, the captain of Saint-Étienne, was sent off for a very, very bad challenge on Kylian Mbappe. But as you say, Saint-Étienne, who finished 17th uh, this year in the Ligue 1, actually put on a very uh, combating display they pushed Paris hard, particularly in the first half, with Dennis Puanga having multiple chances to score a goal. He actually hit the post. Paris, on the other hand, very slow. Both teams uh, suffering from four months without competition. A reminder that this was the first official game in France since COVID-19 interrupted football back in March. Paris Saint-Germain, who confirmed their status as the most successful team in France and the most successful team in the Coupe de France with a 13th title. They extend uh, their reign as the most successful team in the competition. And of course, it is uh, going to be a foothold for Paris to continue because in just uh, oh, less than a week's time, they faced Lyon in the Coupe de la Ligue final before, of course, the much anticipated quarterfinal of the Champions League against Atalanta in Lisbon.